Dude, dude, this. Oh my god, why is she going down? <laughs> go down! Go, 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 go! go <laughs> okay, go, 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 go! Oh! <laughs> nice! <laughs> All right, so when we last left off with Darcy and Stacy, they were fighting about having the twin wedding. Or not having the twin wedding. I don't remember. Anyway, even though Stacy and Florian are already married, they want to have an official real wedding with all of their friends and family. So of course that means Stacy has to have a bachelorette party. And if Stacy is having a bachelorette party, of course it's going to go horribly. Try and guess right now what happens. Yup, you're right. They all end up arguing drunk in the street at 4 in the morning. So one thing you'll notice pretty quickly is all of these people are like 50 years old. What are they doing? How do they have this much energy? I don't even know how that's possible. And they all just keep yelling things like, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's go. And then they, they don't really go anywhere or do anything. They just all get drunk and argue. Wow. We're all in New York for Stacy's bachelorette party. I got us a fun party bus with a stripper pole, party favors. We're going to be doing it big in the Big Apple with Darcy and Stacy. Come take a big bite. What the heck was that? What is going on? They're like, yeah, we're doing it big in the Big Apple. How about you don't do it big for once? You guys are always doing it big. You're doing everything big all the time. Why don't you just take it easy for once? Every time you guys are about to go out and do it big and have a crazy night, it always ends up with somebody crying, someone throws a drink, someone throws a punch, someone falls on the floor. Something like that is going to happen. It's bound to happen. It's inevitable. It's like the sun rising every morning. Ah! Let's go! You might be wondering, who the hell is this guy? Why is he here? Well, I don't know. I have not figured that out yet. Okay. Do it! Let's party! Okay, baby. Oh, God. Florian looks like he is absolutely done with this whole situation. He's probably been in this exact scenario hundreds of times, and he knows that it doesn't end well. So this next part is pretty awkward because they're all dancing on this pole, you know, just having a good time, and then Stacy gets up and she's about to do it, and Florian is like, no, mm-mm. No, 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 no. Oh, hey, what are we all together? I've seen her dance before. <sighs> Flo, give her a free pass, bro. Let me, let me have fun. Yeah. Okay. Give her a free pass. Uh, huh? Give her a free. Um, excuse me. Who are you? Who invited you? I don't. I don't think anybody invited you here. Nobody knows who you are. That's... No, my man. It's not my, my, my uh, culture. All right, perfect. We've covered that. Now that things are good and awkward, let's do some shots. Oh, someone else you may notice is here. Who, who is this? Who's this right here? Are you kidding me? Georgie is here? This is Darcy's ex-fiance, but he and Florian have become such good friends that Florian decided to invite him to Stacy's bachelorette party. Did you follow all that? Because I did not. Stace, can I wear this? Hey, it's all you. Okay, cool. I'm gonna be yeah. like like the best kung fu artist in the world. Yeah, yeah right. oh, baby! Ha ha ha! Holy shit, I just realized who this guy is. I knew I had seen him before somewhere. I knew it. I rock it well, bro. That's well. right. I might get more girls than you tonight. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you ain't getting this girl. Woo! Yeah. Oh, I like how he randomly takes a pause to just stare into space. I am so confused by this man's behavior. Why do I feel like the old person watching this? This guy's like 15 years older than me. Why does it seem like he has five or six preset lines and he's incapable of speaking beyond those lines? Bro! Oh. <laughs> Let's kill it! Let's do it! Yeah! Stay flossy! Yeah, let's kill it! Woo! Let's do it! Okay, do it already. Please. We all know you're just gonna go into a bar and yell at each other anyway. Alright, here we are, everybody. We're all just at the Shut bar. The have. Alright, they do it. Do it. Stop. Oh, oh, relax. Okay, do never mind. Do do do. Never Make mind. Problems. So I'm sure they went to other bars before this one and just didn't show it, but I love how it cuts from them all hyped up outside, running around, to sitting in this quiet little bar, just yelling at each other. The best bachelor party ever been. Of course. You like his parties. Shut the up. Ah, they do it. Shut the up. Relax. Georgie. Georgie. Make problems for no reason. Georgie. Wow. You make me upset. What? Georgie. 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 Wow. 
Alright, so I think the troll guy has kind of been antagonizing Georgie the whole night because Georgie, like, treated Darcy poorly in their relationship. But why is he here? Why would they allow him to be here? This is why you don't invite your ex-fiance to your sister's bachelorette party. Oh, wait, I got that wrong. No, this is why you don't let your brother-in-law invite your ex-fiance to your sister's bachelorette party because that's what happened. That's a classic mistake. But you know what else is a classic mistake? Hooking up with your ex-fiance two weeks before you allow your brother-in-law to invite your ex-fiance to your sister's bachelorette party. One more classic mistake. Inviting a troll guy to your sister's bachelorette party to antagonize your ex-fiance who your brother-in-law invited to the bachelor party. Did you follow all of that? Sorry, not bachelor party. I meant to say twin wedding. Shut the f up. I did do it. Do it. Shut the f up. Relax. Everybody start talking then like I'm upset. I was cool. I like how everybody just puts their head down as if they ignore him. He's just gonna evaporate. All right, so I need everybody to calm down. So. Dude! He has to wait for him. Wow. Georgie. Georgie, let me see. So Georgie storms out, and Florian decides to follow him outside and try to calm him down and clear things up, I guess. But this upsets Stacy because she feels that he's choosing Georgie over her when it comes to the bachelorette party, because he absolutely is. This is just too much. I don't even want to wear this. No, no, Stacy. No, what? Don't do that. Stacy, think about what you're doing. You can't throw out the whole bachelorette party just because your husband invited your sis. Just because your husband. Shut the f up. I Wait a minute. Is this even Stacy or is this Darcy? Hello, hello, hello. Oh God. Well, why couldn't you sit here and stay with us? He's my best friend. Oh, and I'm your. F Right. Yeah, you're my wife. Okay, let's hear that one more time. Yeah, you're my wife. All right. Uh, all right, let's hear that two more times. Yeah, you're my wife. Yeah, you're my wife. Wow. Yeah. All right, I think that's enough. But anyway, it was clearly a mistake to allow Georgie back in because things just get worse from here. So whatever's going on with you guys, you can communicate about this later. Now is the time to rejoice and have fun, y'all. Exactly. I did not fly all the way out here I know. to see both of you guys argue. What? I totally would have flown out there for that. So in this next part, Darcy and the troll guy are looking through photos of some guy that she's talking to right now. They're clearly just trying to antagonize and annoy Georgie even more. And I'm not a fan of Georgie at all, but I don't know what else they expected to happen. The whole situation is just ridiculous. Oh, is that your new man's? He's not my new man, but I met him. Ooh. Isn't he good looking? He's a good looking dude. He's watching in the corner. Yeah. He's hot. Look at sad little Georgie just watching from the corner. The poor guy, he was having a good time. He said this was the best bachelorette party he's ever been to. Can you believe it? He's been to that many bachelorette parties where he can say that. I know what I like. Who are texting? Who is that? I have to DM. I DM. I DM. Who are texting? Who is that? What are you talking to me like that for? Yeah. Your new boyfriend or something? Excuse me? Hey. She's not so with what? you. Hey, pal. She's not talking to you. So why don't you just take your ridiculous hairstyle out of here, or I will punch you so hard your face will get an injury. You could tell it's been a rough night for this guy when he has a dent in his hair. I That's care it. about her. Let me tell you something. You can care about somebody. I care about her and I want to protect her because you, you don't if need she to protect with her. someone else, you don't need to be protect a mistake. Her. Yeah, you hear that, pal? If she is with anybody else, ever, that would be a mistake. No matter who it is, I don't even care. I'm the only person for her. All right. Don't be like this in my face. You don't need to protect Listen, you don't need to protect Oh, why do they all scream as if this was some intense fight? This was barely even a scuffle. Essentially, they gently cradled each other as they slowly fell to the ground. Actually, I think the troll guy brought himself to the ground, basically. <laughs> he just grabbed onto Flory or Georgie. God, God damn it, all these names. This is effed up. Big time. I'm like, on a, on a level, I can't even imagine. And we're in New York City. The city that is asleep! Why does every episode of this show seem to end with one of them drunkenly stumbling around in the street? So of course, nothing is really resolved. I think they just sort of wander around in the street for a while and continue to yell at each other. Look at my Who does that? You come at me like that, violent and malicious, and you wanna destroy my whole You wanna be like that? If you come to the wedding, we're gonna see what's up. We're gonna see what's up. 
let's just take it easy a little bit. You're not in a movie here. You're on Darcy and Stacy. So anyway, that was the tale of Stacy's bachelorette party. It went exactly as I expected. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Just a quick reminder again to check out the podcast if you're interested. It's posted every Thursday night on Spotify and Apple. But yeah, anyway, I hope you all have a wonderful week and I will see you in the next video. Shut the f up. I do it. Shut the up. Relax. We're gonna be doing it big in the Big Apple with Darcy and Stacy. Come take a big bite out of that apple.